ECDL Advanced Access Lesson 30 Cascade Options As discussed in the last lesson, Lesson 29, enforcing referential integrity prevents the deletion or amending of records that would cause related tables to lose integrity. However, if cascade options are set, such deletions and amendments are allowed, but related tables will be automatically adjusted. Records in related tables will be automatically deleted or amended. OK, so we were working with the Custom Computers database last lesson, so make sure you've got that open. To allow editing or deletion of records, the relationship between the tables must be changed. So click on the Relationships button, and again that's from Database Tools tab, and let's right click on the linking line between Computers and Repairs, and then select Edit Relationship. Edit the relationship as follows. Check the boxes for Cascade Update Related Fields and Cascade Delete Related Records, and then click OK. This means that any changes made in one related table will be reflected in the others. OK, let's close the Relationships window. Open the Computers table in Datasheet View and delete the record for Registry Gigathon. So select it and then from Table Tools Table select Delete. This computer has a repair record on the Repairs table. That's record 15. Deletion is now allowed, but the Cascade Delete Related Records option means that the related records, in the Repairs table in this case, will also be deleted. A warning is displayed. We're going to select Yes to continue, but just so you know, if you click No, it would cancel the original deletion. And if we look at the Repairs table, we will now see job number 15 does not exist. Let's close the Repairs table and look back at the Computers table. Where we see the serial number of T2457, let's change this to T5724. Close the table, and then open the Repairs table in Datasheet View. The Cascade Delete Related Records option has caused the job for Registry Gigathon, that's Job 15, to be automatically removed. The serial number that we changed was for Triton Computers. The jobs associated with the Triton computer were jobs 1, 7, and 14. And in all those cases, the Cascade Update Related Records option has caused the serial number for these jobs to be automatically amended. Note, there was no warning message when automatically amending related records. OK, if you now close the table and the database, we have now finished Section 4 on Relationships. We've looked at applying a primary key, applying one-to-many relationships, one-to-one -one relationships, and many-to-many -many relationships. We've looked at applying joins and self-joins, and now we've just finished looking at referential integrity and cascade options. OK, now you'll find in the textbook there are two revision exercises. 
Lesson 31 and Lesson 32. These you should now attempt to gauge your understanding of this particular section. OK, good luck with those, and I look forward to seeing you next time when we will start Section 5, which will be a relatively short section, and it will be on the topic of forms. OK, I look forward to seeing you then.